All right. So this is my old snowblower here. I mean, 1974. That old. You'll see a glass jar on the deck handle. That's to keep the water from getting down in that in that button there. Because these covers aren't perfect. And a garbage bag over the seat. Now I want you guys to realize that the battery in this thing is a 2008, and it's 2013 now. So oh, it is. Ha ha ha! Right. So the battery in this is a 2008 and it's 2023, which means that battery is 15 years old in a lawn tractor. Now I'm going to brag about it, it won't start. You know how that goes. Should go, the lights are on. and it's dirty. It's my baby though. All right, my friends. This is the old one. As far as I could tell, it's a 1974. It has points. I've just wiped it down, got the dust off it. Uh, Put 30 pounds of air in the tires. There was about 10. And in that one, there was about 3 pounds of air in each tire. And I put them to uh, 10 in the back and 12 in the front. Because it's going to sit a bit more before I use it. So anyway, here we are. We're going to try and start this old guy without the cord. It has an electric start. Uh, thanks to Dave in the small engine revival. Oh, we got a leak. Too bad. Probably a needle and seat, eh? Just burn some of that out. Gonna start good now. These Tecumseys love fuel. Should kick on the third one. Maybe not. to have a look at that needle and seat, I guess, eh? I wonder if I got a spark. Brave way of killing. I know there's a little hole in the rubber here. No spark. Oh, I got one. Okay. I'm going to just take that, uh, just take the bowl off and have a look. Well, Mr. Bruce, that's your fault. Nobody else's. So my friends, I deserve every second of this. I got a, a different needle and a different float. And I'm going to stick them in and we'll see how it goes. I'll come back when I got it together. Okay, I got the needle and seat and a different bowl with a drain on it. 
I've never had this problem, but I'm kind of embarrassed to say that I've probably let it go too long. Okay, so now half choke. Well, that's good. It's dripping. Should go on a full choke now. Now we're going to adjust the, uh, the jet, I guess, eh? Come on, girly girl. Okay, now I'm going to put my old gear, probably just killed some grass with that gas. I'm going to put the uh, cover on my lawn tractor. There we go. 
Okay, so there's the two new covers. I'm going to secure them a little more tomorrow. I'm done. I had to almost rebuild the carburetor on that old John Deere there. 1974-1986. Each year they seem to need a little... Whoops! Each year they seem to need a little more love, eh? Well, there we have it, folks. Two tune-ups. Two simultaneous... Simultaneous tune-ups. <laughs> on two of the best lawnmower engines that nobody makes anymore. A Quantum and a GCV 190. The best residential mowers for North America. Big. I think one's a 22 and one's a 21. You just don't, we're just not going to see them in a few years, you guys.